What is up, people of YouTube? Welcome back to another one. I am out here on a beautiful day. Today is April 7th. So you may know what that means. Tomorrow is a solar eclipse. I am in Southern Illinois, in the middle of Shawnee National Forest, Larue Pine Hills. We head up to Trail of Tears here in a minute. Riding some of my favorite roads that I've ridden, ever ridden a gravel bike on. People ask me sometimes when I'm out at events, because we travel quite a bit across the Midwest to ride gravel events, you know, what are, what are my favorites or what are some of the best in this area for the Midwest anyway. Western roads in Colorado and stuff west is a, is a different animal, but I really like it down here in Southern Illinois. The hills, the Oak Hickory Forest, great topography, the up and the down, the roads are just smooth and God, I love it down here. It's one of my favorite places to ride, period. So we're glad to make it down here for the eclipse. And if I was coming down here, I wasn't gonna leave my bike at home and not get a ride in. So today is that ride. Snuck out for a couple hours to ride some of my favorites. So I thought I'd bring you along today and show you some of those roads. So I hope you can sit back and enjoy the uh, view today. These roads are a lot that are featured in the uh, Dirty South uh, Gravel Bay uh, gravel event. It's, I think it's like February, March every year. So if you're interested in riding some of these things, you might give that a look. I know it filled up this year. It's getting more and more popular because people come down here, see these roads and realize how awesome they are. So anyway, sit back, relax and enjoy. Enjoy the episode. <laughs> Coming. times have I've ridden these roads. I've never seen so many people with the uh, solar eclipse. Everyone in driving distance appears to be down here this weekend camping. Living some van life out in the uh, Shawnee Hills. But even on a busy day on this road, a lot of Minnesotans for some reason. Is no one in Minnesota right now? Did it snow or something? I, I don't know. Even on a busy day of this road, it's still... God, this is great. You know, a little bit of rain. It's supposed to pick up here in an hour. So I may have to cut the ride I was planning short. Which is a bit of a bummer, but that's alright. It's 
warm enough that the rain is not a big deal today. Oh good. It's hailing. Well the rain showed up just in time for this paved road section on the river bottoms. I don't know if that's a good spot for it or bad, but got pretty soaked. Road's pretty wet. I'm hoping this gets all of it out of its system today. Clouds and rain. So that tomorrow we get some nice clear skies. See a solar eclipse. So hopefully at the end of the video you get to see that. Anyway, I'm hoping you get to see a solar eclipse on film at the end of this video. But we shall see. It might just be a nice van trip for the weekend to Southern Illinois. That's okay too. Can't ask for too much. I got to ride some gravel before the rain. Feel pretty lucky to get that in. To the van and i think i'm going to take it i got pretty soaked in that rainstorm and that that's southwest of me that that don't look good that don't look good at all right on cue beautiful area. I do miss some of these clear water streams. I used to live in this area when I was going to grad school and uh, I guess I took it for granted some of these roads and stuff here. I wish I would have ridden a lot more than I did. So now I live seven and a half hours away. So I'll come back down here and ride. <laughs> oh well. Such is life. Well, I got rained out on the second part of the ride I was going to do today up in the Trail of Tears. I'll link uh, a couple of event videos from 30 South. I've done that event I think at least three times. I've done a few videos from it. So I'll link those below if you're interested in some of those roads as well. So nice preview today of what there is to offer. And if you're looking for a place with some nice hills and trees, beautiful spot. Maybe not in the heat of summer and maybe not in the middle of winter, but other than that, it's a great place to come ride. Highly recommend it. Appreciate you joining us today. I hope you enjoyed this episode. If you haven't done so already really appreciate if you'd subscribe to the channel it helps us a lot and uh other than that we'll see you next time